Hello everyone, it's me, Lancer737, and today is February 7th, 2021, the fifth Sunday in Ordinary Time, and I'm reading the daily readings from the United States uh, Conference of Catholic Bishops website, and the first reading is, um, I forget that one, uh, it's probably Job since it's about Job, I, I'm honestly sorry, I forgot what that one was, anyway, first reading job spoke saying is not man's life on earth a drudgery are not his days those of hearlings he is a slave who longs for the shade a hireling who waits for his wages so i have been assigned months of misery and troubled nights have been allotted to me if in bed i say when shall i arise then the night drags on I am filled with restlessness until the dawn. My days are swifter than a weaver's shuttle. They come to an end without hope. Remember that my life is like the wind. I shall not see happiness again. And the next reading is the Gospel of Mark. 1, 29 through 39. On leaving the synagogue, Jesus entered the house of Simon and Andrew with James and John. Simon's mother-in-law lay sick with a fever. They immediately told him about her. He approached, grasped her hand, and held her up. Then the fever left her, and she waited on them. When it was evening, after sunset, they brought to him all who were all possessed by demons the whole town was gathered at the door he cured many who were sick with various diseases and he drove out many demons not permitting them to speak because they knew him rising very early before the dawn he left and went off to a deserted place where he prayed simon and those who were with him pursued him and on finding him said Everyone is looking for you, he told them. Let us go on to the nearby village, that I may preach there also. For this purpose have I come. So he went into their synagogues, preaching and driving out demons throughout the whole of Galilee. As I've said before, uh, everything that we're reading our amazing feats and gifts from our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, to easily go into towns and finding the sick and healing them and finding the possessed and casting out the demons from them. It's an amazing gift and an ability that only our Lord had. To the, to the degree that he has it, um, most people cannot easily do it as, as Jesus can. And that's one of the signs, the reason why, one of many reasons why we know that Jesus is the Son of God, besides his own proclamation in the Father during his baptism. Um, What he's essentially doing here, though, is in his mission, it's not about staying in one place and doing these things. He's going to go out everywhere and help everyone. And that's why he is the greatest um, king we could have, can have, or will have, I should say, that we ever will have. I love our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And I also love all of you. So, since this is Sunday, I hope you're all relaxing, and I hope that you all have a very blessed and peaceful day. Sorry about this. My cat is standing on me while I'm trying to do my reading. Anyway, everyone have a a good Sunday.